TikTok influencer Jam Magno sinupalpal si Vice President Lenny Robredo matapos magmarunong sa CNN Presidential Debate. Narito ang video. Panoorin po natin. Attention! Ina niyo ang luta! <laughs> Bago ka mangyengi-alam sa Ukraine at Russia, Siguraduin mo na naibalik mo na ang 6,000 Philippine Islands na kinalimutan mo. <laughs> Hiningi mo na ba kay Odette na ibalik? <laughs> Nangyengi-alam ka gusto mong gawin ng Pilipinas against sa China, ang ginawa ng Ukraine against Russia, BOBA! You will subject us to a war we don't want to fight? And besides, you don't get to tell us to fight a war because it's your supporters that don't want mandatory military training. Kayo ang ibabala sa kanyon? Pauwiin ang lahat ng Philippine Army sa mga families nila? Can't relate. And ikaw ang kumalaban sa China. Makipagbigwasan, makipagpatayan at isama mo ang mga waray. At si Mike Mauna din na, you do not have the expert, strategic, foreign policy of President Duterte who is smart enough to know that to protect the Philippines, we must be friends to all and enemies to no one. Bakit? Kasi girl, muta rata compared sa China. Pag bumahin yan lahat, Patay tayo! Kayo please lang. We are not going to be like you. We are going to think first, protect our families, and arm ourselves accordingly. But if you wanna pick a fight to say na strong ka, it only goes to shows you know nothing. And you should never be president. Good luck AFP pag yan ang commander-in-chief nyo. My God, you're gonna be leaving for Ukraine next? <laughs> Kaya sinasabi ko sa'yo, Len Len. Pag ikaw naging presidente ng Pilipinas in May or in June or wherever, pretty sure not this lifetime, kulit ang mangyayari sa atin. And between me and you, you're the one that's not gonna be safe. And your minions too. <laughs> Ingat. Mwa. At hindi lang po yan, may isa pa. Pakinggan po natin. Usapang real talk. All right. So, ang objective talaga ng kabilang kubol na mukhang kubol ay simple. Para sa kanila sa susunod na eleksyon ay dapat no more Marcos and no more Duterte. Akala niyo ba ganun lang kadali i-erase ang ginawa ni President Duterte in the last five years? Akala niyo ba kaming mga Pilipino ay bulag at maang-maangan? Kung nasanay kayo sa 30-something years na ginago niyo kami, you think we will allow you to go back? In power? You think na mas pipiliin namin si Lenny, si Manny, si Isko, at si Ping? You are kidding yourselves. I tell you, you are kidding yourselves. Do you really think that yung hanay niyo ay mas strong sa hanay namin? We have Sara Duterte, Bongbong Marcos, we have Senator Bongo and Senator Bato de la Rosa. So you really think na kami dapat ang mag-worry? Basang-basa na po ang play ninyo. Uulitin ko, no more Marcos at no more Duterte ang gusto nyo. Kung hindi ba naman kayo limang kilometrong tanga, hindi ko alam kung saan kayo ilalagay. You really think na sa... Sa ganda na po ng pinagkita sa amin ni President Duterte, you think babalik kami sa inyong mga mediocre, inferior, walang kwenta at bobo? Whatever you guys are smoking, that's illegal and we don't want it. If you think in the little sordid head of yours that mas pipilay el namin kayo na wala kayong mga track record, nagkakamali po kayo. 
Kasi nilook down yung si Senator Bongo, pero ding ding ding, 148 malasakit centers na po ang pinagawa as of today. Kaya niyo yung tapatan? <laughs> Minamalit niyo si Senator Bongo, ding ding ding. Mas busy pa siya kaysa sa lahat ng mga bets niyo combined. Minaliit niyo rin si, Sen si Senator Bato de la Rosa, di ba? Eh wow pa lang, naisa na kayo. Ayoko nang i-mention si Bongo Marcos at si Ma'am Sara kasi it's too far ahead in the surveys. Yung isa nga topping the surveys kahit ayaw tumakbo. Yung isa naman topping the surveys pero hindi naninira sa kalaban. And you expect to still win in 2022? Of course, it is expected that your kind will cheat the elections. But let me remind you that the large voting population of the Philippines <laughs> belong to either the DDS or the Marcos loyalists, or those that will never vote for you. So if I were you, continue lang sa ingay. Continue lang sa galit. Continue lang sa pagka-negatron. Because ang totoong mananalo, kalma, hindi naninira, nakangipe, at masarap ang tulog gabi-gabi. Ingat!